The first set of approaches we will discuss is uh, the uh, pointwise approaches. So uh, these are mostly based on regression and classification uh, approaches in machine learning. And for example, if we talk about uh, regression laws and we have a period document pair represented as a vector, we have uh, the value, uh, which is, let's say, relevance label. And we would like to optimize the regression laws, for example, the um, squared the difference uh, between the real scores and the predicted scores. And uh, basically, we um, train the model F so that the regression is all the regression loss is optimized, for example. Uh, so basically, we directly apply machine learning to our task of learning to rank without any change, actually. Another approach is could, could be classification loss, where we uh, treat our labels as classes. If we have labels from zero to four, we have five classes. And then we uh, use a certain classification loss, for example, cross entropy loss, like this, where we use soft max over all the classes. And then again, we, um, so S is the predicted score based on, so basically this, this is S. So we'd like to learn the model F so that, well, this, this loss is minimized. Just standard machine learning, basically uh, either regression loss or classification loss, very easy, right? So you have, you, we reduce the learn rank problem to either a prediction or classification problem where we have the observation period open pair and we have label, let's say the relevant score and we'd like to predict that label uh, for a particular input vector. However, this approach certainly has issues. So what are these issues? So the minor issues are, first of all, there's class imbalance. We have to deal with that. There are very many uh, irrelevant documents and very few relevant documents. So we have to uh, account for that. That can be solved though. Uh, also, the features are very different. Uh, first of all, they're different between each other and then they're different between different queries. Queries are very different. Queries can be long, can be short. Uh, so that has to be uh, also taken into account. You have to perform certain kind of normalization, but all this can be fixed. There is a much uh, bigger problem. There is a fundamental problem with this type of approaches. And this fundamental problem is that ranking is neither aggression nor classification. So basically uh, the document level loss doesn't necessarily lead to lower rank based loss. Because in, uh, when we consider document level loss, we consider documents independently, but of course in the ranking, they're not independent there. Well, they work together in, in the ranking. So basically optimizing point-wise losses, point-wise scores does not directly optimize the ranking quality. And let's have a look at the example that actually demonstrates this. Let's say we have um, five documents and um, only one is relevant and four are non, not relevant. And our function, our model, ranking model F predicts scores of 0 0.6 for the relevant one and 0 0.5 for non-relevant ones. And of course, you see that the difference between 0 0.5 and zero is pretty large. So actually when we calculate this uh, regression loss, we get the value of 1.16 in this case. Now, what if our um, ranking function F predicts different numbers. It predicts instead of 0 0.5 for non-relevant documents, it predicts 0 0.2 for non-relevant documents. So now this difference is much smaller, but that function uh, predicts 0 0.1 for the relevant document that happens to be so. So basically um, each of this non-relevant documents can be ranked first according to our model. For example, this one is ranked first. Obviously this ranking is much worse than before. So before we had, um, sorry, uh, we had this on top. So this ranking was correct, but the loss was uh, large. And in this case, the loss is actually smaller, 0 0.9 to 7 uh, instead of uh, 1.16, but the ranking is wrong. So that just shows that uh, optimizing scores for each separate document uh, doesn't lead to the, the best ranking. So 
Well, just to summarize, ranking is not a regression. It's neither a classification problem. And document level loss doesn't work for ranking because uh, documents depend on each other within the ranking. So we do not optimize the ranking uh, quality directly and uh, a lower loss in point-wise approach doesn't necessarily mean better ranking. Uh, to solve that problem, there's the next set of approaches called pairwise approaches. 